four of Danny Parker, five Marshall Burrow, six Neil Hooks, seven Craig Cullen, eight David Lang, in market over a Christmas hangover as Griffith swings this ball in, looking to the far post. Barlow with the header, it's a free header in the end. But it'll, it'll not test uh, Misovic in the Spartans' goal and go out for a goal kick. As Rodeo looks to swing this free kick in from the left hand side, players waiting in the Spartans' box. Plays it short to Paul Robinson, the ball bounces and bubbles away, but Robinson has the strike. And Castle was unsure, she had to clear, but it'll back in. It's another decent save from Castle. Body really going for it. It's lower. Plays that ball forward. Nice the speed of Barlone. Barlone leaves it from Brown. There's Julian on this left hand side. Looks to take on Nathan Buddle. Skips on to his right. It's going to have a beautiful shot that's just going to go past the post. Great effort from. Uh, <laughs> it was a Julian there. Near Nigel Julian cut inside Buddle. And it's a great effort. So we're not long. Cleared by Kendrick. Brian trying to bring the ball into control. Buddle will header it clear. Robinson will try and bring it down. Won't get the better of Jack Edwards. Oh, no way. The referee says that. Robinson is trying to do a little bit too much. He gives a free kick. Now the referee's going to go to his book. Red card. He sent off Paul Robinson. Yeah, um, he did look as if he kicked out him a little bit, but surprised it's a sending off. It's. Uh, to be honest, if it is a sign off, the Barwell man should be should be going the same way because he's he's, he's pushed Robinson. Balls with Hadland. Hadland leaves it for the other Hadland. Up the line, it's going to fall here. Shots from Luke Barlow straight in the hands of Misovic. Dale tries to help it on for Joe Kendrick. Kendrick's going to swing across in, flicked by Mullen, falls to McGuire! From nowhere, Ted Man Bly take the lead! Good cross from Joe Kendrick. Mullen tried to keep it alive and fell to Dan McGuire, who virtually had an open goal. And with three minutes gone in the second half, Bly's lead at Croft Park. Good overlap from, uh, from Joe Kendrick. And uh, perfect ball in, keep us powered it. And a simple finish from Maguire, but a good finish. Lower up the line, cleared by Danny Parker, falls to Damon. He's not. Well, the center way He's down. not offside Maguire's either. Onside. Maguire's onside, looking to take on the goalkeeper. Maguire, good save from Liam Castle. Maguire goes down for a challenge, wants a penalty. The referee's not interested. Twisting and turning, looking to get away from his man, plays it back to Buller. Buller's going to swing across in, Damon Mullins there, and it's going to be clear, but only as far as Hubbard. Hubbard to Maguire, back on to oh! Hubbard. goes down under a challenge. The referee says a free kick right on the edge of the box. Well, Joe Kendrick take this, I tell you, that left foot is. So to the left foot, you'd feel. Kendrick is going to swing his shot at this, and it's going to go over the bar. Just too much on it from Joe. And Jack Edwards, a force in the feet of uh, Luke Barlow, and helps it on to Daniel Spencer. Spencer trying to help it in to Thomas Wheel. Ball's going to be clear, but only as far as Spencer again. Helped on to Nigel Julian, who's wearing the number 11 shirt again. Julian into the box. Julian's going to play the Great cross. Great tackle into the hands of Michal Misovic after a good challenge. It's going to be flicked on, but comes up Danny Parker. Then for David Mullen, back to Danny Parker. Parker looks good to set him He's onside, you know. So Maguire looks to take it on past the goalkeeper. Castle is starting to cry. Can he put a touch on the ball? The cross comes Jamie Hudden and for another Spartans corner. Hubbard does well to keep it in. Well done, Robbie Dale. And Robbie Dale comes back and wins it. And then loses it to Wheel. <coughs> Wheel lands it on the edge of the box for Spencer. Spencer with the strike. It's come up over Misovic. Hits the bar. And it's going to be put in at the second attempt. The bar will a level. It's Thomas Wheel. It's, uh, you know, he's done well to, to get a hand on it. It was decent effort to bobble right in front when it's a, it's a good finish from Wheel. Dale should be able to clear. And then he's found Julian. Julian under pressure will just return this one in. Good win, Danny Park. Good header from Parker to clear. But he'll try to air. Craig Homer tries to help it on. It's bouncing all over the place. And the end of Forster, a blue shirt. Across comes Brehin. And it's just going to trickle past the post. I tell you what, Borwell fancy they can win this now. As they should, you know, against 10 men, it's, it's, he should be favourite to win any game. 
Parker looking for Dale. Dale oh, what a ball! Nicely into the feet of Dan Maguire. Oh, he's not! And Maguire plays it off the goalkeeper, the flag goes up for us. He's not. But it looked like the perfect run. It was, he held his run perfectly. Great touch from Robbie. Brain all the way across with Scott Lauer. He's got a lot of space and a chance to come forward. He's going to put this ball into the box. Let's go to the far post. In comes Malone! Free header! Great ball into the far post there. Perfect ball in from uh, from Scott Scott Lauer. It's a, he should be doing better there, uh, Barlow. Joe Kendrick got the line, looking for Dan Maguire. Great touch. Maguire with a fantastic touch, 10 away from his man. Needs a bit of support. Maguire skips out to his left. He's going to have a strike! <laughs> what a goal from Dan Maguire! Oh, does this kid ever get here? What a finish! Maguire onto his left. He had a strike with his head into the bottom corner. And somehow, with five minutes to go, Blythe lead by two goals to one. It's a great first touch from Maguire. Took away from the defender. You cannot let Dan Maguire run at you. And they've done that to us, <laughs> you know, to their detriment. He's got on that left foot. To be fair to Dan Maguire, he's not left footed, but that is a great finish. Who's man the match, do you think? Spartans have to break out here. It comes out as far as Hadland. Hadland back to Nigel Julian. Four minutes of added time called. This ball's going to be swung in. Pure lets it bounce. It's going to be cleared and hit beautifully. Hey! Hood and Luke Barlow pull it over from Sorry. six yards out. That's a terrible miss. Wheel, wheel. He's going to swing across in with his left. It's going to be flicked on and helped on by Guy Hadland and cleared. And Maguire's free. If he can get away from Lauer, yes. For full time. Great win. Absolutely Ten man fly Spartans win by two goals to one. Right, Neil, uh, down to 10 men, up against it, concede, but still win. Explain. Just a lot of hard work and determination, down to, down to the attitude of the lads more than anything. Um, we're up against it a bit, but dug in and got the win, that's the main thing. And then, I know many people don't like singling out players, but in Dan Maguire, a player in form and a real special talent. Oh, he's, he is special, to be honest with you. The attitude that he's got and the hard work pays off sometimes for him. Sometimes when you think he's not going to get the chance, he'll nick it out of his feet and he'll get the shot away. And it just proved at the end for the second goal. Does today show what this club means to the players? It definitely does, yeah. There's a lot of you know great, great lads in the dressing room and they want to play for the club and they want to be here. And yourself, it's a uh, first 90 minutes. Yeah, it's like nice. That. Nice to be back playing, you know. I've always want to play every minute of every game and I've had to wait my time for a chance so hopefully I can get a run of games now. And it's been a positive second half to the 2013 but a real chance to start 2014 the high note. Yeah, we're looking to make the playoffs and it's our intentions too. Obviously we had a good start and we've slipped off a bit but um, we spoke about the game, how many points we've thrown away and um, why we want to be in the playoffs, you know, we want to be competing with the top sides in the league. Right, Colin, uh, we spoke pre-Christmas about your targets. How close are we to achieving those? Um, we've huffed and puffed. It's been, overall, I think it's been a little bit disappointing. I think we should have got more than what we did at Whitby. Um, Trafford was a bit of a blow for us. But, I mean, today, when they do what they did today, I mean, we must have played with 10 men for nearly an hour. Um, and we've just dominated the game. How does it feel for yourself and Tom to be in charge of a, a set of lads? who will go through what they did today for you? Oh, I mean, the lads are brilliant. You, you, you can't ask for nothing else. We, you know, we, we had them upstairs before the game today and we spelt it out how much it was important today to win and next week to win after the hitty-missy start we've had through Christmas and they've responded absolutely magnificently. There's no doubt about their attitude and commitment. It's just sometimes there's a little bit of naivety. Yeah. And in um, Dan Maguire, can you sum up just what he does for this club? Well, he turns my hair the colour it is, to be honest. <laughs> I mean, Nipper could have he could have had three before they got a goal. The game should have been dead and buried. Um, but then he pulls that one at the end that he did there. Absolutely fantastic. Unbelievable goal. And obviously, naturally, he'll receive the plaudits, but I thought the back, to, back four today were outstanding. Yeah, I mean, I've got to say, Danny Parker, since he come back into the side, has been like a rock. Strong as an ox, absolutely brilliant he has. You've got to say that. Uh, Buddle, again, consistency's coming with him. He's a young lad, very consistent. I just give us a good reaction after that. And Joe Kendrick's come back in has added as well. Looking ahead, Stocksbridge on Wednesday. Uh, another good chance for three points here. Yeah, well, it's got to be three points. There's no two ways about it. If we want to stay in the chase, we've got to get three points from Stocksbridge. 
Um, it doesn't make us hit the target if we get the three, but it gets us close.